Hey everybody, welcome back to Northern Land Plays Sekiro. We're back in this place. But I gotta say, to me, I think there's a decent chance that this is the forest behind the base which was spoken of. This may indeed lead to the valley that sinks and also probably stinks. Maybe speak to the merchant over here. He's like, hey, I want to see the Buddha return to the freaking uh, temple. Yeah, well, I don't know how to do that, buddy. I want a toilet made of solid gold, but it's just not it's in the cards, is it, baby? All right, well, I don't know. You want to... There's not a whole lot I can do for you, my friend. Here's what I... Here's what's within my wheelhouse, all right? I can kill you. And that's about it. Really thought we could make that jump. All right. So what do we do? Well, did we kill the headless down here? Obviously not. At least... You do make me slow as freaking molasses. And I guess terror just kills us. We gotta look through our inventory for terror related items. It's the only way I see us having a chance. Hold on. Hit him with the firecrackers, dude. Wow. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you. I think that uh, enemies that create terror can basically ligma, as far as I'm concerned. I don't, I'm not saying that just to appeal to to the youths. I'm telling you, breaks the effect of illusion techniques, reduces flinching from enemy attacks, divine blasting. Large posture boost, eel liver, banishes lightning, pacifying agent, reduces terror buildup and increases terror resistance. Okay, so this, we'll drop one of those, and uh, I think it's a divine confetti situation as well. I, I would love to get a stealth kill, dude. I don't think it's going to happen, but, or a stealth hit. They notice me. <laughs> so, pacifying agent. Sweet, good start, dude. Did it, did you even take it? Yes. Okay. Next step. Um, divine confetti. Run, dude. Really incredible start so far. Like, if anything... To be honest, I'm predominantly mad at the birds. Like, I understand why the Headless will be mad at me. I just don't understand why the birds would be upset. <laughs> Alright, okay. May I leave? I've made a huge mistake. Perhaps you would wish to fight me up here instead, where there's not a cloud of badness? Yo, stop that, okay? Oh, you are the cloud of badness. Don't grab me. Oh, dude, this sucks. You might think I'm I'm losing mental 
health, wherewithal, etc., etc. I really just want to stop fighting enemies that do terror damage without me knowing what the solution to, to fighting them is. And I, I don't know, it might be the same thing that I was being a baby about earlier. I don't think we have the tools to beat the corrupted monk. It turns out, spoilers, we the tool was inside us the whole time. But for now, I think, definitely, like, stop just beating your head against it. Behind the woods. It's the freaking Sunken Valley, dude. Maybe, now that we have the, the, the swimming power, we can just jump in. This is the Mibu village. You know what? I'm dumb. Also, where did... Have you guys been here the whole freaking time? Or is this the first time I've encountered the Shichimi warriors? Uh, I mean, obviously we saw them last episode as well. I just means this is the first time we've encountered the ghost variety. You're lucky there's a lantern there, my man. Probably one of the, like, 1% of players that played this and didn't immediately, uh, go back to the area that's rich with water. Please tell me this isn't called Sunken Valley. Okay, this one's Mibu Village. But maybe, dude. What is that? Poison attack! I feel like I got you, but it would be way cooler to not kill you by using firecrackers, but that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> that's not a prayer bead. Yeah, it's... Oh, a treasure carp scale, dude. Well, we kind of ran through this area earlier. There's no doubt about that. You're, you're cool, dude. I already bought your gourd seeds, so, like, don't sweat it, okay? I don't really care about you guys. Like, you guys, as far as I'm concerned, you don't really bother me. It's only when you aggro that I'm going to aggro as well. So this time, instead of going in the land... I'm gonna go into the dang old water. I don't really care about these fish. They do, they do not bother me. What on earth is that? What? A free prayer bead? Fish, do you really want, like, I understand that you don't have a concept of me being the strongest warrior in Earth's history, but, like, just promise me when I tell you, you don't want any part of this. I don't really want to deal with you guys either. Like, you guys are just living your lives out here in this fishing village. I feel like it's kind of annoying for me to come in and ruin your lives. Simultaneously, y'all are pretty annoying. Maybe if you can mind your own business as a villager passes through. I mean, why are you afraid of me? Just because I'm not from around here? All of a sudden, I'm like a bad dude or something. I don't know if we ever peep this area. It appears we did not. Yo, this is all lore stuff. I'm not against it. Will we ever use it? Now nah, it's a different question altogether, isn't it? That was a great shot. Okay, so then the second spirit idol. I I did have other plans, to be honest. Now that we've rested. 
Thought maybe what happens if you jump in this river over here? Because I'm assuming the altar is where you go to the divine realm because they said that the altar is where you go to the divine realm. Um, so I don't know what's going on down here, brother. Of course there's a secret under the waterfall. You fool. Is it a prayer bead? Not a prayer bead. I thought maybe. Um, so you know, you know you're like, hey, NL, you can stop pretending now. It's not really like that. That was a real treasure card. Should have gone for it, dude. As much as I am loath to admit it, I don't know where to go. Was there another area we didn't fully explore? Like, I thought we were pretty much done with the Sempo Temple. The only other thing I could think of is we go speak to uh, the young lord. Right, I, I feel like we got to be close, but um, you go speak with the young lord and uh, ask him about the other side of the, the other thing we need, and then hopefully it just kind of appears to us. We got to listen to his dialogue a little bit more. This is the only part of... And, and this probably doesn't happen to everybody or maybe even very many people at all. Um, I, when I get confused about where to go in these games, that's where my frustration starts to set in a little bit. It's not... You know, I'm an adult. I can deal with it. It's pretty minor. But simultaneously, I'm like, you know, where am I going? I see you've gathered... Keep yes, up the that's correct. So... That is, but it is. Hmm. Hmm. What's law finding a stolen? Tree? Let us gather what. As we... you would. One part of is a white flower that blooms where the fountainhead waters run deep. Yes, my lord. The sunken valley is. Be There's a shrine dedicated as the name and. There's no prop. You know, Wolf. My lord. The only other thing I can think of right now, and I, I was listening, believe it or not, was. Well, you know, I don't think we've peeped, like, underground waterway bottomless hole in a bit. Um, I think it was around Senpo Temple. There were a lot of NPCs. And there was also... They were talking about a white flower around here. And remember, this thing was like, don't go. And then there were, you know, you, are you doing okay? I mean, I, I, dude, I basically saved your life. <laughs> where could it? Yeah, dude, where could it? Give red and white Is pinwheel. This what you, uh, I'm looking for a pure white flower, but you, thank you. A pure white flower. Where is it, dude? Mm, yes, yes, that's. No destinations to introduce. Can't tell him anything he doesn't already know. Apparently. Then there's the weird, like, kite thing over here. <laughs> like, oh, you're you're not a good man. My mistake. Wasn't there a lady down here? The lady was like, hey. Maybe there's a point to fly in the freaking kite. I don't know, dude. I doubt it, but there it goes, dude. Incredible. It's all to get a cool look at the shadows, which I'll admit look lovely. I'm just looking for water now. You know, we're getting dangerously close to me having to use my phone a friend, which in this case is Mathis and Austin. There's three headless enemies I have not killed. One very annoying uh, terror lord. 
You know what? I don't do this to, too often. I'm Google where to go after stone. Sekiro. Dude, it auto-completed. Nah, not where to get the stone. Hold on. Once you got the stone, he'll unravel the story for you. There's so... <laughs> Dude, people are so mad. Where the F is Mibu Village? You're given zero description. You've got to throw yourself in the abyss of the underground dungeon. That's where I just went, dude. Okay, hold on a sec. How to get this, okay. You get the Gunfort Shrine key. Use the key to unlock the door. Oh! Fight Long Arm Centipede Giraffe? Did I not kill him? Dude, I'm dying. I'm, I'm dying because I know I'm looking at a guide here, but it says the back of Ashina Castle. What side is the back of Ashina Castle? You know, okay. Where is Sunken Valley Sekiro? Ah, here's the thing. You gotta exit the back of Ashina Castle. Give it a second, dude. I'm so close. After defeating Genichiro, it's done. Genichiro's defeated. You don't have to worry about it. Head to Ashina Castle. Make your way to this thing. Then it's not a link. I'm dying. I'm dying. I mean, I'm not saying the guides are bad. I'm saying I'm dumb. But... I feel like I've I've been there, but I haven't been there. This is engaging gameplay now for sure. Head to Ashina Castle. You know what? Here's what we're gonna do then. We're gonna I can only imagine that the next step for us, um, as I as I take yet another homeward idol, and by the way, I, I, w oh, I meant to go to the other one, but I I would have been stressing about this earlier, but um after the monkey fight a lot of people were like, hey, NL, we watch you for the situations like this. And so now I feel much more easygoing about it. You're generally, you know, for real, seeing a man lose his mind slowly while I play this game. Um, but the other thing is, please don't take offense to the fact that I don't know where I'm going. Sometimes you get lost in a game and you go, this sucks, dude. And then people go, well, don't blame the game design. I'm not blaming the game designers, okay? I'm just, I'm lost. Ashina Castle. Then you go to the serpent idol, which I don't remember. And, okay, here's the thing, we defeated Genichiro. It's easy, dude. I mean, if I was to look at this room, what would I say is the back of it? That's a great question, brother. You know what? Perhaps this is the back of it. Right here. And maybe that's the forest, dude. Maybe you gotta go over this dang old bridge and see what's going on over there. Perhaps, perhaps indeed. You guys are having a bad day, huh? If this is the wrong way, I have nothing to offer in my own defense. Dude, this guy's not messing around for what should be a relatively early enemy. I do have to admit, he has a cool shirt. Cool shirt strikes me as uh, an enemy that maybe is a little bit more on the difficult side. You didn't want any part of this, man. Feel bad for that one. It's a forest at the back of the castle. Through a Tori. Through Dude, this has got to be it. Okay. I don't want to say I did it myself. 
That, that would be a little tone deaf. But like maybe I've done it myself. The Mibu Balloon of Spirit, of course. Have I not rested here? You guys, are you wearing a baseball cap? Oh, I'm, dude, it's this guy. It's Sunken Valley, dude. Okay, we were only lost for 20 minutes. That turns out that's the back of Ash in a Castle. Oh, my controller has become disconnected. It's perfect timing, though. And I'm being sincere. Give it a sec. It's coming back, dude. I'm going to purchase a bunch of spirit emblems. Because we were... Oh, wait, do we have 336 in tow? Never mind. Uh, I thought we had 13. You. Who are... Hmm? <laughs> they find a way in through every crack and crevice. There's always more of them to kill. By the way, have you mastered any secret techniques? Yes. Mm. Mm, not quite yet. No? It seems. Never mind. Cut them down, Sekiro. Every last one. Alright, what do you what do you got going for me, dude? Have you mastered mm -hmm. not cut them? Alright, well, that's fine. You know? Nice to see you again as well. It's a new area. I'm in love. Okay, that's probably where you start. Oh, new content. There's nothing like the sweet smell of new content in a From Software game. Especially when it's not underwater. Snow, I can live with, dude. Just throw yourself off the edge, dude. What could go wrong? By the way, what's attacking me? Oh, okay, gun lords. So I didn't mean for such an uncontrolled descent. You would think that I don't recognize you. Guess what, you son of a gun? I do. I fought many of you before. That's I actually wanted to res because I screwed it up really badly. It's not like ah, you can't kill me. I wanted to die. It's more like I screwed it up so bad. We might as well restart. Two of these jokers. It's a little annoying. Hey, hey, don't you do this. No! <laughs> Finally made it to a new area. And it was just like, man, let's die instantly. Okay, take a deep breath. <sighs> new Sekiro area. Oh, dude, we're not running around uh, places we've been a hundred times before. I love it. Have you ma- Not got the- All right, the thing is I haven't mastered any secret techniques yet. So, you know what, buddy? If you got a problem with that, you can leave. One of the things I, I like to do in this game is just jump to my death routinely. This will be much better for us. Terrible timing. Now I do see... A spirit idol, which is actually called a sculptor's idol. Seems very soon after the previous one, but sure. I guess that's why the thing I read there was talking about snake eyes. These are the same sorts of fellows from earlier. I'm actually... This is a vain hope in these sorts of games. But I'm sort of hoping... We did things out of sequence, which might imply that we're about to get an easier set than we just had earlier. But who knows. You know what? You did a great job there. I can't be mad. Well... I can be mad, but for other reasons now. <laughs> That's hilarious. Alright, still five heals. Nothing to complain about. Hello? Easy enough. All according to Keikaku. It's been a long series so far. 
can't remember, or I, I had forgotten is what I mean to say. Keikaku was originally part of this. I mean, temporarily, we were like a, we were an esteemed warrior before we started to bumble around a little bit. Now we're bumbling. We're still doing pretty well. I don't know, man. It's like the bosses for the most part. Let me let me rephrase because it makes it sound like I'm high on my own farts here. The uh, the traditional ish from software bosses. Oh, <laughs> not so bad for me. Didn't mean to drink that. They tend to not be so bad, at least. What always ends up being actually for real bad are the non-traditional weirdo bosses, as I like to call them. That requires some kind of new mechanic. Sometimes it's a puzzle, oftentimes it's not. Not as adaptable in these games as I used to be. You're done, dude. I was too close for you to shoot me. Classic PUBG-esque maneuver. Lots of sculptor's idols here. Not too difficult of a fight. Some scrap magnetite. Can actually use that to get one more upgrade. We were getting a little light earlier. I just want to go until I see another boss. Because I think I got the, the capability to have a chance here. We're doing good work. Sunken Valley hasn't been... Too much of a problem so far? Are you in, you're an NPC. The gun fort. It was even more formidable. Nice. We were reckless. I got the key for that, dude. Go. It takes me back. You know, you give me some spirit emblems or something if you're gonna die. Like, if you're gonna die, at least provide me with some usefulness, dude. Oh, oh, it is. I'm gonna have to imagine that this is probably the gun fort. Hello. Clutch. You definitely seem faster than your counterpart. But. Great move, great move. I, I thought it was a sweep because it was an overhead, um, which makes no sense, but let's just ignore it. Um, I am much stronger now than I used to be as well, although you wouldn't know it from me continuing to jump away from you rather than doing something useful. But the itchy manji, dude. Thank you, people who recommended that maneuver to me. It's doing incredible stuff. Heal. You're in a good spot. Now you go for it. Fair. Good trade. As long as you don't immediately get hit afterwards. Dude, we're gonna... Before the end of this episode, we will win this fight. I know we were less than halfway there. In Souls? In Bloodborne? In Sekiro, in my experience so far. 25% of the way through the health bar is halfway there. Thank you for the Unseen aid. I really appreciate it. Um, you know, my mom taught me to always be thankful, dude, so... If you, once you learn the pattern, even if you sucked on your last fight, you stand a chance to win on your next fight. Which is why I am relatively unconcerned. Get your firecrackers out. Don't get caught by that. We're basically the luckiest people on Earth. Good, good shot. I forgot. You know what? You did a great number on me there, but you're going to turn around. And I'm going to heal and very nearly get hit. This is going okay. Get used to the, the ebbs and flows of a sword fight. 
You gotta hit this. You, yeah, okay, you know what? You did a you did a great job that time. Um, you, you're much stronger than the other one, I think, but I th still think I'm gonna... You, you, the thing is, it hasn't been really a good episode from the perspective of me, uh... Sorry about that. Uh, it hasn't really been a good episode from the perspective of me, uh... Proving my prowess to any degree whatsoever as a Sekiro player, so, uh... I'm eager to have the opportunity to do so. AKA, bring it on, Shira Fuji. Every time, dude. Okay, we got a we got a problem. We have a cat in front of the screen. Let me repeat, we have a cat in front of the screen. Is he gonna do a a, a rotate and sit? Yes, he is. Okay, he's back down. Crisis averted. Huge. Parry spam, by the way. Can't see my health bar. It's because of the aforementioned cat in front of the screen situation. Okay, here's the thing. Res me, dude, and then immediately heal. We lived, you coward. One of these days I'm gonna get that. Huge. You got it. You got the loop. Now just don't get hit by the minions. Wow, that was a great shot. You you know what? You're pretty good. Here's what we're going to do. Ruka, you're my best. Uh, you're one of my two best feline friends on the planet. But you got to go down to the box. Daddy's got to be able to see his own health bar. Daddy also has to stop dying. Because if I don't stop dying... Uh, I'm gonna continue. Ooh, whoops. Uh, I'm gonna continue to get unseen aids. And if I continue to get unseen aid, uh, chat's gonna be like, streamer luck, I wish I was the streamer, etc., etc. So it's up to us to fight back. I'll tell you straight up, I'm a little embarrassed by this fight. Corrupted monk, real challenge. Water lady, real challenge. Snake Eyes Shirafuji shouldn't be giving me this much trouble right now. Really, really smart move. That's incredible. What can you say? But that was a. Now I realize this boss arena was set up to make this situation come to pass. And you would think that I'd be mad, but I'm actually de lighted. No unseen aid that time. What? Bro, but I had a 13% chance, dude. It's like guaranteed. Okay. This is the one. Like, what bothers me is that this isn't even hard. Just want to explore the rest of the arena here, okay? Then you shoot. And then we do you with one of these. Sorry, right. we still got the posture gain. And then you do one of these. It's all right. We still got the posture game. And then you do one of these. Where are you? Show yourself, you coward. I was in the midst of greatness. So we're... All we got to do to put it together... Whoa! What the heck? You come around this side, okay? We had you, and you know it. That's the thing that bothers me the most, is that you gotta know you were about ready to get bodied. You got saved by one of your minions. Again, never do that. That's bad muscle memory. Hit him with the itchy manji. Huge. Whatever, we got the posture. I understand why you would be frustrated, because I have been in your shoes on this one. Come get a taste. Basically, 
You get a window. You dumb idiot. That's me, I'm the dumb idiot. You get a window, you do the Ichiman. And look at that. Okay, come face me. You're so smart, come face me. Huge. We lost like no posture. I've mastered the game. Get in there for an itchy. Screw that up, but not get punished for it. Recover more posture than you deserve. Gun. Not today. Itchy Manji. It's that easy, dude. That's that's textbook secure all right there. Lost a few times. They had us in the first half. I ain't gonna lie. But what did I tell you, dude? You fight a... You get a boss 25% of the way dead, you're more than halfway there. Whoa! You heard about the movie Bridge of Spies? This is like Bridge of friggin' Size, dude. Whoa! Wasn't even paying attention. Easy. Very hard to shoot downwards. They're close. Whoa! I, uh, I'm dumb. Didn't even see that guy. Whoa, dude. Cool it, brother. Stop. You can make it. You just gotta be cool. Turns out, I'm cool enough. Dude, I don't care. Give me another boss literally right now. I regret my decision immensely. Do not give me another boss. Give me HP. Thank you. Okay. I had a full five point plan for how to deal with this. That's not the, that's not the best start, to be honest. See, now I don't feel great about that. I don't really know if that lady had much to do with this whole gun fort situation. Don't feel great about it. So I'm going to say, you know what? You guys enjoy your life. Um, Gunpowder. But, but how? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay. The music calmed down for a split second. You know what that means. Guaranteed safety. Stop! He doesn't know. Oh! He knows, dude. Really thought that was my window. I think our best chance kill one super quick. That's a great move. Would have been a lot greater though if you'd managed to hit me. But you know what? Rome wasn't built in a day, brother. Keep working on that. Next time I'm through here, you might stand a chance. Thanks for the gunpowder. Thanks for the coin purse. 
Thanks for the medicinal pellet, which I have not used in ages. I was gonna say, you don't look, or you don't leap before you look. That's gonna do it for this episode. We finally made good progress. Take a little rest here for now. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, and I'm gonna be back. See ya!